Born near Paris in 1943 to a modest family, Patrick de Marchillet spent his childhood in Le Havre with his mother and four brothers. For his 17th birthday, his stepfather bought him his first Eastman Kodak camera, which is how he learned how to develop film, retouch negatives, and began shooting friends and weddings. After leaving to New York in 1974, he discovered fashion photography by working as a freelance photographer and learning and working with contemporaries that influenced him, like Henry Cartier-Bresson, Terry King, and Jack Gilbert. He later worked for Vogue and Harper's Bazaar, first in September 1992, which resulted in a 12-year collaboration. The images that the influential photographer Patrick de Marchillet creates have shaped the way we see fashion for more than four decades. That perspective tends to be a happy, fun one. He's an optimist who finds vitality in his often smiling subjects. Initially hired by Condé Nast editorial director Alexander Lieberman, de Marchillet began his long relationship with Vogue in 1974. He believes the key to a strong portrait lies in the truth of the subject and a certain natural quality, for people to be who they are and to be themselves. Famous for his iconic images varying in subject, context, and settings, from portraits and fashion to nudes and nature, the iconic photographer considers a career spent snug in the eye of the fashion industry as something of a happy accident. It came naturally, he says. I didn't think about a career. I didn't plan it. It just came. De Marchillet's portfolio is an extensive timeline of the highlights of the fashion industry topped with an exceptional Dior Couture book, portrayed in black and white, of course. Besides portraits of celebrities and royals, de Marchillet has started advertising campaigns for a who's who of international fashion and luxury brands, including Calvin Klein, Giorgio Armani, Chanel, Gap, Gianni Versace, Dior, Louis Vuitton, Celine, Chanel, Yves Saint Laurent, Ralph Lauren, and Gianfranco Ferri, among many others. Alongside all of this, de Marchillet was granted the Clio Image Awards Lifetime Achievement Award. His design aesthetic is one based on originality of the subject, directness and intention, and the lightness of production. I have learned that Patrick has remained himself over four decades of work, and for him to be unwavered by the demands of the fashion world is astonishing. He never changed his style to become more modern or bright and bubbly, bubbly and popular. He remained true to his signature shots, black and white, and a plain background. It feels modern because it's timelessly classic. When asked what his favorite portrait is, he says, people expect it to be Princess Diana or someone famous, but the answer is my dog, Puffy. They think I mean Puff Daddy, but no, it is my dog. Thank you.